the first thing you do in football is assemble a portfolio, you know, and it has to be a properly diversified portfolio with each member fulfilling a specific function. You know, you couldn't just go out and rank the best footballers in the world and, or the best footballers that you could afford, let's say, and, you know, take the top 11 from that ranking because you'd end up with a team of goalkeepers. So you're constructing a portfolio based upon a limited budget uh, where you're uh, trying to identify what somebody is worth and then comparing that to uh, what their price is. And it's a market that's desperately inefficient, but it's, uh, very opaque. Um, so, uh, and where there really isn't this concept of value, you know, there isn't this concept that uh, a player has a price, but that, that is different from his value. So trying to get a grip on that is really, really interesting, interesting problem. <laughs>